<laughs> what time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. You know just where it's at. Right down there. Right down there. And it's time to find my Instagram. That's Geekly Amanda. G E E K L Y Amanda. It's the same on Twitter. Make sure to follow me there too. And it's time to get this reaction video started. Right, y'all. This week I'm gonna call Mahabharat week. <laughs> I'm gonna call it because I have to go out of town. It's I have to go to a funeral and everything. It's gonna be. I don't know if I'm gonna have videos every day, but if I do, it's gonna be my Mahabharat because I have been watching them. And this season is one of the most like inspirational. I mean, this is when you know our our June and and Krishna before the war have their little their little you know heart to hearts get together krishna informs arjuna all this stuff and we're going to take those episodes kind of one by one i started watching a little bit but i stopped because i'm like let me do the little recap up until there let me get the little review up until then and then we're going to take because there's like three episodes of those so i was like this is going to be episode eight nine and ten because then they have 11 12 and 13 that's you know specifically with you know, Arjuna and, and Krishna and Krishna teaching Arjuna all this stuff. So I feel like those are going to be in depth. So, you know, last we left off, you know, Karn done, done ripped off his his armor that's attached to him and, and the earrings. He ripped those out and everything. And he was suffering over there. And then the twins came with their, their special herbs, right? And they, they healed them and all. Well, now they're about to get, I mean, this war is what, the, any minute, any minute this war is going to start. So they're preparing. Karn comes walking in. To, look, he's all, I'm, I'm healed. <laughs> I don't know if he even told them how he got healed. But he's like, I'm healed. I'm ready to fight. And you know, you know, the mean prince, he's happy to see Karn. That's his BFF forever. Right there. Them two right there, be best friends forever. Him and Karn. Well, Bishma ain't having it. Because first, you're right. Doesn't Bishma kind of know? Like, he tells Kunti, he's like, I know that was your first child. I know you may miss that. Like, so I was like, how long Bishma been knowing this? How long has he been keeping this under the wraps that he, he already know about all this? I don't know. I don't know. But I feel like then he goes in there and he's like, he, he tells him, he's like, you can't fight until you, you know, tell, tells Karn, you ain't in this fight until you, you know, pledge your loyalty for me. And I'm like, well, this is why I don't understand. I'm like, Karn, why can't Karn just be like, okay, I pledge my loyalty. I mean, you can pledge your loyalty to two people. He already done pledge his loyalty to me. Prince can he also say, I pledge my loyalty to you or, or they ain't having it. They're like, no, you can only do one person because what if they come, you know, head to head there? What if that happens? Well, Karn ain't going to do it. <laughs> Karn is not going to pledge his loyalty to Bishma. I mean, you kind of expect that. He's always number one been for the mean prince. And the mean prince has got his back there too. He's like, fine. The Karn's my number one. Karn's by my side, Bishma. If you don't let him, then then you don't have to be the general of this. Karn will be the general. I mean, the mean prince was going to do that. Till Shikani, wasn't it Shikani to talk some sense into me? Like, you know how Shikani at for my darling. That's what all he says. My darling. My darling. <laughs> <laughs> Shikanti always do with his nasty stuff all over his teeth. Uh, uh, or was it Karn that said it? One of them that said it, they were like, listen, you see all these guys about to fight out there? They ain't fighting for you. They fighting for Bishma. They wouldn't be here because they, they have their loyalty in Bishma. You know, not even their loyalty, their faith. They're like, they're they going to stay. They they have the battlefield knowing the general's going to protect them and... and Who's the number one to be on there? Bishma. And then they even said number two. And then number two is the Drona. <laughs> he was even like, it goes Bishma, Drona. And if those two die, then it's on you, Karn. Then you could have it, Karn. Then you could be the general and then follow you. But these people ain't going to follow you. Mm -mm. So then I'm like, well, so Karn's not going to be in the war until, like, if Bishma and Drona die? Is that how it's going to be now? He's just going to have to wait sitting there watching for for then the Bishma and the Drona. So they're going to die early then, huh? So then you find out that Krishna is going to be, you know, Arjun's chariot rider. 
And first that June was like, no, you can't take that position. And Christian's like, oh no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ride in front of you. I'm gonna be your chariot rider, like driver. We, we're not doing, we're not playing these games. We're not playing these games that I'm not fit for this. I'm too high for this. This is war. <laughs> Christian is saying, this is war. I'm going to be there. It don't matter, you know, cherry tear, nothing. The, no, there's no titles up in uh, right now. We're, we're going to fight for the righteousness. I was like, you do it, Arjun. <laughs> you do it, Arjun. You listen to Christian. Do you know you're gonna, he's going to listen to Christian? And then, so what was going on too? So they, they had their armies there, right? I mean, they got their armies ready, lined up. And then Yudi's like, well, I got to get the blessings from, what, what did he say? Do, does he need the blessings from uh, Bishma in, in the drone or whatever? Because he, he rode his little chariot up there. And he's like, but, oh, and then that's what he said. He's like, I, I want your blessings. And then they were like, well, if you remember, well, Bishma was saying stuff. But then, you know, Shakuni and that mean prince, they're all, well, if you don't get the blessings, does that mean you're going to surrender? And he's like, yeah. And then they, then they was like, that, don't give it to him, Bishma. <laughs> Tell him to surrender. Don't give him the blessings. See, these are the moments I like Bishma too. Because what did Bishma say? Bishma was like, listen, I, you got my body. Remember he would tell the Kura, the mean prince and all this? I, I gave my oath to my, my body. I will fight for his thin poor. I will fight for that. I'll fight for the mean prince. I'm going to sacrifice my body. Give you, like, you know, fight. He's like, but you can't take my heart what do you say my heart and my mind and my soul like all that like that's mine i done gave my oath for my body the rest of this is mine <laughs> he was like and you can't tell me what to do with what my heart tells me what to do and my mind tells me what to do and i'm gonna give them my blessings oh they was mad oh they was mad it was given you know you know how the mean prince does he's all <laughs> he does and she cut it off with his life but this is this is what I was I was wondering about because you know we haven't talked much about that brother. What's that brother's name with the with the mustache? It starts with the D, the D- Syrian or whatever. Out of everybody, I even out of sh- like you know one of the people I I can't stand the most, the mean prince, Shikani. You know, I I can't stand them. They they in the bottom of my list. I you know I want them done with. But even that they even have like. You know, they even give something to to the epic, right? To to these stories. They, I mean, Shakuni's the the cunning, cunning. He's got he's smart. He could devise. I mean, he's got his great qualities. If he used them for good instead of evil, it'd have been even better, right? If Shakuni used his qualities for good, like his his cunning and and his thoughts and his plans, if he used that for good, I mean, that would have been great. But he used it for evil. But still, he's got those qualities. Mean Prince, too. Look at him. He's, like, devoted to... He has his friendship with the Karn. I mean, you know, he, he has his good, good qualities, too. And he uses them sometimes. But that's what... Mostly bad, also. <laughs> but, I mean, at least he gives something. That brother... I don't know. I can't stand him. I can't... I think out of every single person in this, that brother, the, the second brother, that one that would have been... The next in line for the for the throne after the mean prince he just he gives nothing <laughs> to the story all he does blindly just felt like whatever the, the 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 mean prince tells him that's what he's gonna do that's what he's gonna do whatever the mean prince tells him that's what he's gonna do i mean even the other brothers that one brother remember what they were doing that to Drapati and trying to unrobe and he was like, this ain't right. Remember that one? And that's one of your way younger brothers. One of the, the 98, you know. But this brother just do whatever he does. And then, I can't stand the way he looks. He's always like, <laughs> he hardly has lines. He, they hardly ever give him lines. And then when they show him, he's always got this face like... <laughs> Doesn't he? No, really. I would take it off. Like, whenever they show him, he's got this face like... I was like, what is he over there doing? I had to get a little couple clips. <laughs> I had to go. We got to watch some of these clips together, this brother, because why does he get on my nerves so much? Ready? Let's, let's, let's. I just did like 10 second little clip. Go. Look at him. Look at his face. And he's all, look at him. Look at him. 
Why does he crack me up with those faces? Because he don't contribute nothing. He's one of these. You know, I watched the, this show called Survivor, and they call them floaters, like in the game. They have the people that, you know, plan and, and, and a major part of the game. And then they have the other people just sit around, and, and they see, like, the powerful ones on there. And they just, like, sit back in their background. Don't do anything positive or negative, except make the faces. Look at him. He's all, <laughs> you know, make the, except make the faces. But they don't contribute nothing, good or bad, to it, right? That's what he is. He's a floater. <laughs> That's what I'm going to call him a floater. And he wasn't like him when, when Bishma. He wasn't. He wasn't like him. Bishma's like, I got my own mind and, and my own and my heart. And you can't tell me what to do my heart. I'm going to get my blessings. He was doing all, <laughs> doing all this stuff. But then on the other side, <laughs> I kept looking at, at uh, Lord Krishna. Lord Krishna, because I was like, look at Lord Krishna. He's over there just watching. Right, you feel like Lord Krishna knows what's gonna happen, right? Cause it's like kind of fate. He he knows what's gonna happen, and and I felt like he knew this was gonna happen, and he was just sitting there waiting, like, oh, I can't wait. Like he loves. I feel like Lord Krishna loves the drama. <laughs> Am I wrong on this? I feel like Lord Krishna loved the drama. So he's like, oh, this is, oh, I can't wait to watch. You know, Bishma tell them he's gonna follow his heart and mind. And he's just sitting there, and then he'll give smirks. He's like, it's like he knows what's coming. He's like, and then Lord Beast will be like, I follow my heart, my mind. And, and Krishna's like, I was waiting for this. Like, that's what his face looks like. He's like, I was waiting for this. And he'll turn to Arjun. I, look, Arjun, you watching this, Arjun? Like, like look at this drama going on. I got I got a front row seat. Why does Lord Krishna met, crack me up with this? So I had to do a little, just like that meme, that crazy brother with his faces. I had to give a couple little seconds of Lord Krishna just giving us little smirks. You ready? Let's look at these. Go. Look at him. Look at him smiling. <sighs> look at him. Look at our Jude. Look at him. He's like, oh yeah. Oh yeah. I was waiting for this. <laughs> Lord, Lord Krishna cracks me up with this because he's like, you're doing the right. That's why I feel like he's like, you're doing the right thing, Bishma. I've been waiting for this. And I can't wait to see the Shikani's reaction, the mean prince reaction, the, the brother with his reaction. Lord Krishna loves the drama. He loves watching that tea. So anyway, that happens, right? And then they're, they're all ready for war. They lined up. Then they go to, you know, the blind king over there. And he's tripping over everything. <laughs> Poor blind king. I know he's getting old. And now all his sons are off the war. And ain't none of them going to come back. The Godardi's over there with her cloth soaked with the tears. Oh, I love Godardi. She's one of my favorites too. Because she's so devoted and everything. Oh, I, I do. I love Godardi. But I mean, she's over there trying. And then the um, Ved Via, the sage, you know, the one that kind of, the one that, you know, made right he made the, the blind prince and and pandu he was the 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 i forget what they're called but after that one guy died the the one you know king or whatever or they made him king the, the father right he's the one that that sage that that got them pregnant through the divine i forget i know there's a special word i done forgot it but anyway he's there right and he's gonna come visit and he's like he was got he offered the, the sight to the blind prince. Remember, blind prince always wanted to see. He was mad at Gadari because he's he was like, You're gonna make this oath to go blind, and, and you were supposed to be my eyes. He was mad, and now he's like, and that and then the sage was like, Well, I'm gonna offer you like the divine sight. You can watch this, what's going on, the divine sight. And then he's like, Oh no, I don't want to watch. Never mind, no, no. <laughs> I wouldn't want to either though. He's like, to watch the war go on and stuff? No. And he was like, and then what it didn't have, the sage was like, oh, you you wanted to see all this time, and now, you know, when it comes down to big events, you don't want to see now. You want to look and turn turn a blind eye. No pun intended. Then he offered to Gadari. Now you know Gadari wasn't gonna do it. I mean, she she's like, I made this oath. I can't do that. I can't do that. But still over there, the, that blind prince, he wanted to know, right? He's like, well, I want to know what's going on in the war. Because he offered to, to Vidur too. To, to, and Vidur's like, no, none of them want to see this. I don't, I don't, listen, I don't blame them. 
I don't like watching this stuff either. My husband likes watching the boxing and all, and they punching each other. I'm like, I don't want to see all that. So I'm with him. So then he's going to give the poor servant, his, one of his servants, the blind king, like, give it to him. Give the, him the blind sight so he can tell us what's going on. So he gave it to him. He gave him that blind sight. And now this is when they, they the war's about to start. Like, it started, right? And and right at the end is when, you know, they're about to start in our June. Was like, Krishna, wait. Lord Krishna, wait, please, wait. Like, he, he wanted to stop. He's having all the second thoughts. And this is, I guess, when it's going to be like, Lord, the time Lord Krishna, you know, teaches those lessons to, to Arjuna. And we're going to have to go through that one step by step. We're going to have to do that one step by step because I feel like those are just... I watch. I start watching some of them, and it gets deep. We're gonna have to really analyze these. So it'll be coming this week. I don't know exactly when. I have to go out of town. Emergency. A funeral came up. So, but just stick around. Keep watching. And let me know what you think. Comments, thumbs, all that. Until next time, y'all.